Save the whole time. I'll do anything you want. Let her stay! I make my own economy. I know I've had enough delight for one day. Today is the day I earn the get a Krabby Patty. Generations, each member of our family is set off on a quest to be the best of the best, to wrestle the toughest, meanest animal around in order to truly earn the green name. I'm gonna wrestle the wildest animal this city's got. Now remember, do you have what it takes, boy? Oh, get ready, Grandma, because today I'm becoming green. More for Tilly. <laughs> You can't hide them from me forever! Exactly! Yeah. Let your guard down! Let your guard down. Hey, Grandma, let's say I'd... You'd have to change your name to something stupid, like stupid or stupid, but that ain't gonna happen. Stupid! Now put your clothes back on. You look ridiculous. If cunning and clever is what Grandma wants, then that's what she'll get. <laughs> One, two, three, ha, ha, I, I did it. I'm a green. Right, Grandma? Hey. You think pinning a squirrel is an accomplishment? I fought a bear. Bears are basically real life monsters. Exactly. Yeah. Cricket has never found bears agreeable. You're dang right. Bears are a menace. They'll terrorize the innocent, rifle through our garbage, and eventually destroy this good city. I met a bear in my life, and for that, I consider myself never lucky. Ah! Alice Dolores Green! Hmm. Listen, I thought I couldn't do this because there weren't any ferocious animals in the you city, but I was wrong. You were wrongfully wrong! The meanest, most vicious creature was right in front of me this whole time. The meanest, most vicious creature was you! <laughs> Well, all right. Congratulations on finding a worthy opponent. But... Yeah! Ah, uh, SpongeBob is enjoying a bowl of cereal. Holy shrimp! The sky had a baby for my cereal box! What are those Neanderthals up to? The sky had a baby! Whoa, what do you think we should name it? what you've done! We didn't do it, Squidward. Our hands are dirty. Well, I'm gonna get to the bottom of this thing. A few inches later... Shish! SpongeBob, how long are you gonna stay in your little fantasy world? A giant shish! Right, let's get that poop! Let's have breakfast over there! Shish! Squid! Wait! Doesn't this place is Yes! Whoa! No, no, it's not... Squidward, this 
It sure belongs to the Red Baron. Who be disturbing? The Red Baron. It's with <laughs> insult to the man. Are you gonna try that again? Probably. Now listen! <laughs> Take that booty! <sighs> hey, move your big behind! Your big behind! My behind's big. I'm not. Technically, it's to scale. Will we be getting your big behind? <laughs> You're part of my crew now, and our job is frighten people and frighten people. Now you listen here, man. Oh, now what? I suppose you're gonna show me. Oh, 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 gee, that's very nice. Oh, what is this? Some kind of magic act? <laughs> Would anyone else like to enter the fly of despair? <laughs> Would anyone else? No! Well, we know our place now, Mr. Dutchman. We'll do anything, anything you say! Just have mercy on us! Then for starters, you can swap the deck! <laughs> Look, Patrick, a really, real ghost mob! Hot! Listen! <laughs> We're heading down tonight for a little bikini bottom spree. So I want this ship to look scary! Never mind what it means to look scary! Crew, what a night, Venus! Oh! Eh, that'll do. Since pink ones work in the navigation, it's up to you to find our first victim. Little sis. Captain, there's a guy we can scare. I had four biscuits, and I ate one. Then I only had three. Ah, it does me heart good to see children out after dark. Moving behind the rocks. And stop. Don't worry, Captain. Just jump out. Why do you think the Dutchman asked us to wait in our bunk room? Maybe he's gonna give her an oversized coffee mug! Stop bouncing! <laughs> wait! I have an idea. Really? What is it? An idea. Is it a healer? But the door is locked. And the only way out is out. Let's do it. <laughs> I always hate going in there. Yeah. <laughs> Give me back my sus. Everyone knows I can't eat without it. Never. Okay then. <laughs> Boy, I'm glad all that's over. Squidward, you're back. back. That's enough. Hey, we're home. You did it, SpongeBob! We're safe! Victory Screech! So, you like kicking butts, do ya? Well, we'll show you, old man! Come and get me! There he is! Fight, 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 fight! TV! It knows what I want! Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We have a very important announcement. It's recap time! Oh, wait! Who did you meet today? Um, who was it? Weak sauce. It's just for a second, I thought. Oh! Yeah, you got the same reef blower as me! <laughs> second now. SpongeBob. Huh? Whew. Almost. 
I love you. No, no. Hello. Yes, can I help you? I'll be moving in now. Are you alone? No. Are you now, or have you ever been a sponge? Yes. It's beautiful. Heaven at last. <laughs> oh, which way to the living without a brain seminar? Don't be late. This place Town is great. Beautiful. Got a pineapple in sight. <laughs> 304 New Life Street, Squidward speaking. No, this is Patrick. I would really be impressed if it had Academy. Scorpy. A trio. Oh. Ah, another great day. Now we just gotta convince Squidward to come back home. You got our apology cake? We're ready. Hello, can I help you? Can I get a large number one extra size? I guess we gotta order inside. We might as well rename this town Squidward's Paradise. What can I get you boys? In angry mob form. Any one of these Squidwards could be the real Squidward. Are you Squidward? You Squidward? You Squidward? That's okay. Take your time. Merry Christmas! Well, we know one thing. It's bad guy. Become entrepreneurs. Zickers. Think, Patrick, if you could have anything in the world right now, if you could have anything in the world. Uh, think no, something real. Chocolate bar? Here are. That's a great idea, Pat. We'll be chocolate bar salesmen. Here we are. Make way for a couple of maneuvers. Wow. Good. Good afternoon, young lady. Could we interest you in some? Because I would have preferred an actual conversation. Yes, sir. I've seen your death in my mind. Okay, the first guy didn't count. This is our real first step. Would you like to buy some chocolate? You guys want to be mediocre salesmen if you ask me. Is it a wow? It's a bag, you knucklehead. We need them! We need them! So long, boys. Happy hunting. Let's try next door. Huh? Say, weren't you the same guy who sold us these candy bar bags? Yes, if you kill ladies are to be without one of my bag carrying bags. Oh, what can I do for you two nice young men? We're selling chocolate bars. Would you like to buy one? One chocolate bar coming up. <laughs> I got it! One chocolate bar for the calling! Goodbye! What doing so well, Patrick? Let's get naked! Why don't we try being nice? Oh, okay. Yay. Remember, Patrick, flat the customer. Make him feel good. Wanna buy some chocolate? We got him now! G go away! We sold one chocolate bar. We're too easily distracted. Huh? Yes, say. Back up! I can't understand what we're doing wrong. I can't understand anything. There must be something to this selling game that we're just not getting. Other people do it. I mean, look at that! Eat barnacle chips. They're delicious. They are most certainly not delicious. Not the way I use them. 
Yet they sell millions of bags a day. Well, maybe if they didn't stretch the truth, they wouldn't sell as many. That's it, Patrick. We've got to stretch the truth. Choco Pies! It'll make your hair grow. Great. It's trying to grow a beard. It'll keep your face from getting any uglier. I'll take 20. They make you fly. You'll fall in love. You'll rule the world. Are we living the fancy life yet, SpongeBob? Not yet, Pally. First, we got to spend all the money. But what are we going to spend it on? I love that story. Are you tired of being called average? Average? I'm sure average. Then join me. Nobody's a nobody. And everybody is weird like you and me. SpongeBob's bad. Let's put it! Wait a minute. Tight down, we're gonna be late! We're gonna make it! We're gonna make it! Dude, we made it! Dude, we made it! <laughs> Here's the lemon tree you asked us to pick up. The guy sold us a lemon, you know what I'm saying? Muscle man, high five, go watch Mordecai and Rigby. Rigby, Rigby. We'll be right there. Rigby. What? No way! Those guys are turds! Oh, this blows! You know what the worst is? The smell? Yes. Whoa! Great. Well, well, well. Now get in the back so I can supervise you. Whoa! This song rocks! I don't know how long I can take this. Whoa, dude! You just passed the nursery! What? Where are we? It's lunchtime. Lunchtime! This place is the best tacos in the city! Hmm. All right. Let's see what you can do with a burrito. <laughs> Dude, he blow a fuse. We don't have time for this. No can do. High Fives has got to have his tacos. Watch this. Whoa. Whoa, let's eat. <laughs> it's getting late. Shouldn't we be at the nursery by now? High Fives get away with slacking off at work. That's cool. Let's ride, babies! Whoa, dude! You just passed the nursery! What's the hurry, Grandma? We have all day! Let's have some fun! <laughs> We're here! Well, I'm glad this is finally over. You just passed the park! We have all day! Let's have some fun! Ah. Oh. I haven't had quality bro time like this in ages. We should do this all the time. <laughs> Dude. Mordecai? What was that, bro? Muscle man, whenever you say stuff like that, that joke doesn't make any sense. What do you mean? Well, for example, your mom! Help me out. Your mom! Your mom! Your mom! Your mom! Your mom! Your mom! You know who else can't tell it? Are you making fun of my mom? You're making fun of my mom! No one makes fun of my mom! You ladies are about to wish you were never born! Get out of the cart! You're gonna get it! Nobody, Nobody makes, makes fun, fun of my mom! mom. Nobody! <laughs> <laughs> Muscle man. <laughs> ah, closing time at the Clusty Club. It's the worst time of the day once again. <laughs> Closing time! Closing time! <laughs> the saddest time of the day! Closing time! The happiest time of the day! 
Didn't you all have a fun time today on our adventure?